Hi, welcome to Simply Scuba. Here we have the Mara's Quad Dive Computer. So this is a large display uh, dive computer, nice big digits, very easy to read. Full button user interface makes it very easy to navigate. Let's take a closer look. Okay, so let's take a look and see what you actually get inside of the box. So opening it up, the first thing you see is your dive computer. Uh, we're just gonna take that out for now. Underneath it, you have your user manual. Uh, so that's very uh, sort of interesting, very useful to uh, just go through everything. Lots of different languages as well. Uh, it's worth a quick read through just so that you know what the computer is trying to tell you. Uh, underneath that, you have further information uh, about dive organizer, uh, just warranty information um, inside of that as well. So let's take a look at how the dive computer works. Okay, so the dive computer itself is uh, it's got a nice big screen, uh, but it's still nice and compact, so it's not too chunky on your wrist. Um, it's not gonna get in the way, it's not gonna be too cumbersome. Uh, the strap itself, what's really great about this strap is, first of all, it, it comes with this sort of elongated standard strap so you can wear it over a wetsuit or a dry suit. On the end of it, you have a nice uh, loop so you can attach a lanyard onto that. Very comprehensive, very uh, sort of reliable strap. But what Myers have done is that if you push these pins out and remove these straps, you have four sort of loop sections, anchor points, so that you can fit a, uh, a bungee strap yourself if you want. So that's some good sort of forward thinking. Uh, if you want a, a nice bungee, uh, uh, bungee strap system on it, you can have that uh, just by taking the existing strap off. So the four button user interface to, uh, to navigate the menu, very quick and easy to, uh, to get your head around. Uh, the screen itself, nice big open screen, nice big easy to read digits. And everything about the screen is, uh, especially in dive mode, is, has its dedicated sections. And you have those on the side here. So you have depth along the top, so uh, your sort of maximum depth, your current depth, your decompression information, how long you can stay at a given depth, and then time and auxiliary uh, information uh, underneath. So I'm just going to um, sort of navigate around. So you have the enter button, the escape, which is like a back, and then up, down. Cycling through the, uh, the menu, uh, very simple, and back to the front. Uh, so all I'm gonna do is change it from air into nitrox mode. Uh, if you go back around, BT stands for bottom timer. So if you want to um, just monitor depth and time, uh, you put it into bottom timer. Just for regular air, recreational, it goes into air. And then from a nitrox, you get into this menu. So I'm gonna change it from 30% up to uh, 32%. So I wanna enter. Uh, I just want to go up to, enter again. You can select your maximum PPO2. I'm going to keep it set at 1.4, and it gives you your max depth. If you've got um, separate gases, you can have up to three gas mixtures uh, on this computer. Uh, so very quick, easy to adjust. Um, nice, simple user interface. Um, very quick, easy to, uh, to get to know this computer. And that's the Mara's Quad Dive computer. If you missed my latest episode of Scuba Tube, you can click on this link up there to watch that. Thanks for watching, safe diving.